for the base, you want to go ahead and use a beige translucent color. Next, we will go to our acrylic paints, and I am using four different colors. Gold, silver, a bright pink, and I mix my own blue by using a darker blue and a very light blue. First, I went into the gold color, and you just want to make two lines. So start at the top left corner, and go to the bottom left corner. And making this kind of arc shape and you're gonna do the same thing on the opposite side so you're gonna start from the upper right corner and again make that shape arc shape and then you're gonna end up at the lower right corner and of course you will take probably two or three coats of acrylic paint to get this completely opaque and for this color we're gonna start right over here besides the gold and we're gonna just make the same kind of arc line And we're going to do exactly the same thing on the opposite side. Now let's just move on to the pink and the silver and we're doing exactly the same thing as before. Now I am just going to go over each color again so that they're really nice and vibrant. And if you need to, you can go over it a third time just so that it will really pop. I went over each color twice so you can see that the colors are really vibrant. And the good thing about the acrylic paint is that they dry super fast so you don't have to wait a long time to do this design. Next, we're going to go in with this polish. This polish is from Pure Ice. I'm not sure if it's still available. I will go ahead and put the name in the description box down below. But um, you can use any nail polish that has this kind of iridescent shimmer to it. And we're going to go ahead and apply this polish to the two um, sides of the nail. So like right here in this space and in this space. And before this gets a chance to dry, we're gonna go ahead and apply some stars from this nail polish. And I'm just gonna go ahead and try to get the stars out. And we're gonna go ahead and apply to this area and also this area right here where I just applied the nail polish. Now we're just gonna go ahead and let this completely dry and come back with the next step. You see small size starting to dip into the gold acrylic paint and just go ahead and add some dots right here on the right side as well as the left side. And now just go ahead and let this completely dry and come back with the next step. Now I am going to go ahead and top coat and also add our decorations. So that is pretty much the design and I don't have clear acrylic. If I do, I will go ahead and put it underneath the bow so that it will last a lot longer. 